Nicole here and some of you might also know me as my drifting desk where I help you conquer college and today I'm bringing you another shop with me dorm haul video um, I'm not sure if you already saw my other video but I did mention I'm gonna do two different videos one on the cheaper side and one on the kind of more expensive side but not too expensive just to give you all some options on what you can and cannot buy or this is the video where I kind of show you how to shop on a budget but also getting your money's worth at more expensive stores like Target or Bed Bath & Beyond we're gonna jump right in first store we're going to is Bed Bath and beyond so let's go so literally as soon as you walk in there's like this kitchen area but I'm gonna show you how to use different items differently in your dorm room for example there's this like shelf it's supposed to be like a spice rack but literally you can put this up in your desk you can use this to keep you know your pencils if you put little like cups on top of here to hold like your pencils your pens and stuff have like a layered desk organizer so that's something that's like in the kitchen area but doesn't have to be utilized in the kitchen area like literally something so simple as like shelf liners usually people use them in their kitchen if your dorm has like drawers in them put them in your drawers because you don't know who has those drawers before you and it's a little dirty so I always just shove those in there everywhere at the bottom of my closet before I put shoes down other little like kitchen stuff I see are like these acrylic bins that are supposed to be used for kitchen stuff I guess but again you can put these in the drawers of your desk to hold your pencils there's different sizes of them so they can come in handy literally anywhere you want to put them they can be used in your bathroom they can be used in your bedroom they can be used in the kitchen but usually drawers don't come with kitchens my sophomore year I actually bought one of these and I put it on the top of my desk because I had like a hutched desk and I would put books in between them. That way I could organize my books more in like a timely manner and that way they weren't stacked and I had to like get them out. I don't like stacking because it's harder to get stuff out from that stack. So I like to do them this way. Okay, enough with kitchen stuff. Let's actually go to like the dorm stuff before I tell you guys to buy anything but actual dorm stuff. One thing that you do need is a laundry basket and I mentioned it in my cheaper video. Don't buy a little pop-up one that's mesh because that is going to break as soon as you try to walk it down the hallway. It's going to snap, it's going to rip because you're gonna wait until your laundry basket is full to do your laundry, aren't you? Mm -hmm. Okay, look at these laundry baskets. They like collapse so that when you aren't using them, you can store them. And I actually really like that because of course dorm rooms are tiny. So when you don't have a lot of clothes, it can be tiny, you can shove it underneath your bed. As it's getting bigger and bigger, bigger, you know that you need to go do your laundry. And then once it doesn't fit underneath your bed anymore, you need to take that downstairs. I got like a heavy duty bag that I kept into like a bigger one. Oh. Literally like that. So you could take this bag out and take it with you to the laundry room. I know I said stay away from mesh, but again, if you buy it from a more expensive place, it's supposed to be better quality, so I would do that. Instead of buying a mesh bag from the Dollar Tree or Five Below, just buy one here and you can keep it in a cute little box. That way you can carry that to your laundry room without having to shove the whole box or bin. And I don't know if y'all are short like me, but literally I bought a step so my freshman year and I still have it. I keep it in my kitchen and I'm gonna bring it back with me to my sorority house. So buy a step stool if you're short. If you can't reach the top of your closet, if you need to actually if you have a lofted bed and you have trouble getting into it, just buy a step stool. You can get little acrylic carriers to hold like your makeup and stuff, but I am gonna do a little shameless plug to my cheaper video. There's actually acrylic bins that you can buy at Dollar Tree that are just as well, and I hot glued my, I have bought six of them and I hot glued them kind of together to do my makeup stuff. We have more acrylic bins. This one's huge and really nice. Go check your Goodwill because I bought this exact same thing at Goodwill a couple months ago for literally $3. And I'm now looking at it like, wow, I, I didn't know it came from here. Because of course it's Goodwill, they don't have tags on it. But I literally bought, it's $40. And I bought the same thing at Goodwill for literally $3. Uh, I'm happy now that I found that. <laughs> Everyone swears by these and I absolutely love them, but in your dorms it's even better because they're very thin and you could fit more clothes in your dorm closet than you can with a normal hanger. I mean, look how thin this box is. And that's 30 hangers in there. You know what I mean? 30 plastic hangers would be like three of these boxes. They have a lot of these cute little like accessory hangers and I would actually recommend getting one. They have some in cute little shapes because they can fit in your closet or what I did my freshman year is I put a little command hook on my wall and I hung it up on my wall as kind of like a decor if you have cute little scarves and stuff. Sorry, I have to stand on my tippy toes. But if you get a cute little scarf holder like this one, it's cute, it looks like a little purse and you can hang that on your wall and hang scarves on it or put jewelry on it. I mean, you can use it for anything. So just for my curiosity, I found these pretty much exact same bins at Five Below in my cheaper video, which y'all should check out. But I'm just curious, so these ones are $5.99. At Five Below, they were $3. And they have slightly different sizes, but even the ones at Five Below have like really small ones, like medium ones and large ones. Y'all, look at this. This would be cute on like your side table so you can put like your phone in it and like jewelry, because these are kind of like velvety. Wow, this is gorgeous. Hello, gorgeous. <laughs> Always check out the clearance section, y'all. Bed Bath & Beyond definitely has a better selection of cuter bins, of course, so if you're going more of like your preppy, cutesy style. Okay, who knew that Ugg made bins? 
I had no idea that they dabbled in the dorm accessory department. So like desk necessities, I love magazine files. Again, like I told you before, I like to hold my stuff vertically this way or so I could grab it easier than like stacking them. So I get a lot of magazine holders to hold my books and papers. So another little shameless plug to my cheaper video, this same exact little um, shoe rack or like clothes rack was at five below and it was literally only $5 and it had the same material on it. Uh, I can't find the price tag on this one, but if this one right here is $29.99, I can assume that this one's also kind of expensive. Okay, this whole wall is a necessity for you because I'm sure y'all know that you can't hang stuff up in your dorms. So I would invest in a lot of actual command hooks to hang stuff up because you can't nail holes in the wall. Hang on. So every dorm room necessity is literally a full body mirror. So I would definitely get one. This one's about $20. I'm sure you can find one cheaper at Walmart. Oh my goodness. These are so soft, y'all. Ugg makes blankets too, y'all. I had no idea. One of these, like, I think they're called like husband pillows. I used one of these religiously my freshman year. And this one looks like a cat, so I'm here for it. But if you want to, I would definitely invest in one of them if you plan on sitting on your bed and doing work. So I found a pillow that describes exactly who I am. I finally got it all together, but I don't know where I put it. If you find it, let me know. In case you didn't know, your dorm bed will be a twin XL. So you can't find these um, comforters or sheet sets or anything like that at a cheaper store. You do have to kind of spend some money on them. But I would actually recommend spending money on them because again, you want them to last. I got mine and it's lasting me all three, four years of college. So spend that extra money on a good sheet and especially a comforter set, just spend it. Do it. I know it's going to suck and you're going to hate it. Do it. Okay, but seriously, why does Ugg make beds? I thought they literally only made shoes. Right now they have all these cute aesthetic colors for twin XLs. And I actually am loving these two, the gray and the, the soft pink. That's like the theme of my room. And I'm going for this whole color palette right here, so I'm loving it. Okay, not to be funny at all, but I actually bought one of these my freshman year and I hooked it onto my bed because I lived in a bunk bed. So I had the top bunk and it was a lifesaver because you know like heat rises and stuff, I got so hot up there. So if you're in a bunk bed or you're in a top bunk or even just you know that you get hot when you sleep, don't buy a big fan, there's no room for it. Buy a clip-on fan because they work. I still have mine. More than likely your dorm room's gonna be all linoleum kind of stuff, so buy a rug. Get some warmth in there because when you get out of the shower you get up in the morning and you touch that floor, you're gonna hate it because it's gonna be freezing. So buy a rug. They're gorgeous, they're soft, amazing. And they're only $20. And they're huge, whoa. And for Marissa, Nicole, and for my dressing desk. I didn't even do that, but <laughs> it's a sign. These mirrors are super cute and they have like organizing trays at the bottom so you can actually put stuff in them. So if you wanna do your makeup here, you could actually leave some of like your beauty essentials in the tray. Oh, and it has like the super zoomed in side and then a regular side, $13 absolutely a yes you need a shower caddy if you're living in the dorms and you're doing communal bathrooms i personally use one of the stiffer ones for mine but that's kind of because they didn't really have mesh ones my freshman year there's no way that you're going to want to hand lug all your stuff from your room to your shower so buy a shower caddy i saw some of these at five below and they were five dollars for like an individual one but you can get four of them for 20 bucks here at bed bath and beyond so that might be an upgrade for you and the ones at five below were wire like this one so it depends if you want a wiry look or if you want like a clothed look look at this so this ottoman is like a folding ottoman and then you can put your that is so cool i've never seen this before y'all and it's like 20 bucks but it's an ottoman so there's storage inside there's a pocket on the side and you flip the top over and you can put your laptop on it so you could put this whole thing on your lap under bed storage is definitely a must it depends on how tall your bed is going to be um if your bed's just on the floor get these little thin under bed storages Yikes. Highly, highly, highly recommend over the door hook racks. You will be using those. I got some to put on the back of my bathroom door. That's where we hung like our towels and stuff. So I would recommend at least getting one. All right, so that's it at Bed Bath & Beyond. We are gonna go to another store now to check out some more little pricey things and some nice quality things, some more fun things for you to possibly get for your dorm room. All right, store number two that we're going to is good old Target. I love Target. It's one of my favorite stores. I worked there last summer and it was amazing. Literally the first thing that you see when you walk in at their little Target dollar spot are some storage cups and a whole bunch of cute little colors. It comes with four of them so that way you can store, it shows like pencils and stuff which obviously you can. You can also put little makeup brushes, you can put anything in here, your rulers, stuff like that. So these are really helpful on your desk. They have this like wheel of clothes pins for I think three dollars it was, yeah three dollars. I would hang up some pictures with these. This is super cute for dorm decor. Right next to it is another cute piece of dorm decor. You can hang this on the wall. It has a cute, it has a little hook. One thing my freshman year that we always had outside of our door was a dry erase board. My roommate and I would like write each other notes on it and like let them know like hey we're out to eat or something like that. So also like your friends down the hall will like write you notes and it's super cute. So I would, I highly recommend putting a dry erase board outside of your dorm room. The dollar spot also has these cute little 
little jewelry organizers so you can hang your necklaces and has little pockets on it and also little holes so you can hang some like scarves I'm assuming so if you're still looking for little like space savers like that Target has you covered they also have some colored acrylic bins if you're looking for some fun stuff to hang put some you know desk stuff in or even your makeup in they have drawers here they also got your shower caddies covered I mentioned to you before about the husband pillows and Target has some too under 15 if you're like me and you don't have a green thumb buy fake plants because then you can't kill them if you want your room to be super fancy get a neon light and i want the cat so bad because it's super cute and you can hang it any well it's a sitting this one's sitting it has like a little post on it so don't hang stuff up in your dorm unless you're using command hooks these little signs are such a huge thing right now and i think they're so cute and they're only 20 bucks here so you can like write your own little message and it like lights up the command hooks here might be a little more cheaper than the command hooks at bed bath and beyond so we'll do a little price check look at them but you'll definitely need a lot of them now honestly target has it beat from the dollar store because they're a dollar for an eight pack but these are two dollars for 18 so you might get more bang from your buck coming here if you have space in your closet I suggest getting some stuff like this because it really saves space for your shoes or even sweaters and stuff and I also recommend using one of these on the back of your door even your shower door to put shower stuff in or on the back of your normal door to put like snacks or literally anything your hair supplies you have a hairspray they're so just like multi-dimensional so you can use them literally anywhere here's some more really good you know college um, closet stuff to hang under bed storage super useful shoe storage that's unique this is like a really interesting piece because it hangs on the back of your door and it has little rods and it's like an aesthetically pleasing way to like hang up your scarves or wallets and you get like these little like s hooks to hang different stuff on you could put your jewelry your sunglasses literally anything on here and i really i like that if you watched my dollar store like my cheaper video you saw that i showed you these at five below and these were like three dollars and here they're six dollars like cute little like sets like this are perfect to go inside of your desk drawers to like organize all of your space so you can put like your notebooks or big stuff and then put like staplers mini stuff your tape pencils and stuff like that to help keep your desk organized i highly recommend getting your like twin xl sheet sets from target because they're super like well priced this is 10.99 or 9.99 for like your sheets and all that stuff and even like your bedding here is more like reasonably priced than bed bath and beyond and honestly i think they have cuter stuff all right so that's it at target i got to show you some of the stuff that they have there especially for dorm decor and focus more on like dorm decor or dorm stuff so there you go all right y'all so that was everything at target and that's everything that i'm going to show you today for this video in terms of my, my um like more expensive kind of video for dorm decor and stuff so we did go to bed, bed bath and beyond and target to look at some stuff if you have other stores that y'all love shopping at let me know down below help each other find some good deals and get ready to go back to school in like a month i know i go back in literally a month and i'm so excited if you found this video helpful please give it a thumbs up so that i know that it was helpful and that you guys like videos like this because i'll gladly make more of them and go ahead and leave me a comment down below make sure you subscribe and turn on that big notification bell so that you get notified every time i post a new video but i just wanted to say thank you so much for following me today thank you so much for watching and please be sure to check out like more cheaper route of this video the on a budget balling on a budget kind of video and i'll link that down below as well so thank you so much and bye